Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Philly Beats You, and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to catch the legendary Pokemon Cresselia in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. If you enjoy this kind of content, make sure to hit the like button, and if you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. Let's go. So the first thing that you want to do is go ahead and open your map, and you're gonna fly all the way over to Kenilave City. So go ahead and do that. Once you arrive in Kenilave City, go ahead and cross this bridge, come down by the Pokemon Gym, and then you will see a sailor over here. Go into the house by the sailor. Once entering this house, you're gonna see a kid in a bed. Go ahead and talk to the kid. Little boy is dashing about in his sleep. He appears to be in torment. He is muttering something. Dar, dark is watching me. That's it. After that, I gotta go ahead, exit outside of here. Go talk to the sailor. It says, I've lost my love of sailing since my son fell into that horrid nightmare. I need that lunar feather from Full Moon Island to awaken him. Would you go to Full Moon Island for me? If not for me, then for my son and just say yes. Only you can awaken my son from his awful nightmare. We're both counting on you. Then you hop into the boat and the ship starts sailing. By the way, you need to probably be in post game for this and have the national decks done because Cresselia is not in the regional decks. Then you will arrive at Full Moon Island. We're gonna go ahead. Garatina is definitely in my way right now. Come on, buddy. We need it, we, come on. All right, <laughs> go through this area. And we're gonna enter into this spot. And then just like that, there is Cresselia. Gonna go ahead and click on it. And it's gone, flew off somewhere. There is something sparkling where the Pokemon once was. So go ahead, pick up this Pokeball. And just like that, you found the Lunar Feather. It wasn't too bad at all to actually get it. So I'm gonna go ahead and head back to the Sailor and sail back. That Pokemon you met was the Lunar Pokemon. I've heard tales of it flying from place to place throughout Sinnoh. Oh, that sparkle. That must be the Lunar Feather. Thank you. That will wake my son from the nightmare. And then, boom, we're sailing back to the mainland. Just like that. Go ahead inside the house. Talk to the boy. Then it says, your lunar feather began to glow. The boy's living face became untroubled and serene. Oh, the little boy woke up. His eyes, are, yo, those are some big eyes. Sailor man walks in. Oh my gosh, you're awake. Oh my son, I don't know what to say. Thank you, we'll never forget you. Seeing you back to normal makes me feel great. I've regained my spirit as a sailor. Come sail with me later. And I kind of feel like I'm doing a let's play right now. After you complete this entire quest, I'm gonna go ahead and open up my map and fly over all the way to Floroma Town. This is going to be one of the best locations where you're going to be hunting roaming Pokemon. This includes Miss Spirit and Cresselia. You basically want to position yourself in this area. Open up your Poke app where you see the roaming Pokemon and position yourself between Route 205 and the Valley Windworks. And what you're gonna wanna do is just keep going back and forth until that legendary Pokemon happens to spawn in the area that you are in. I'm just gonna keep doing this nonstop. Hopefully this can happen anytime soon. Is it gonna happen? Nope, not yet. So you just it's gonna change. Every single time you change a new location, it will literally just jump to another spot. So I'm gonna open up my Pokemon app that tracks this legendary Pokemon Cresselia. And as you can see, it's literally on the same location as me right now. This is this is so cool. So I'm going to head over to it. I'm going to save right before I walk into the grass because you don't want to deal with it. There's basically one strategy that is the safest thing to do. One, save your game before walking into the patch of grass. Two, use quick balls every single time on the first turn. Three, if you happen to fail, just reset the game and rinse and repeat until you get it. You do not want this thing to reset and you travel all over the map, so please Turn off your autosave when encountering this Pokemon. Let's walk in the grass. And here it comes. That, that wasn't supposed to happen. Let's try that one more time. <laughs> and there it is. There it is, Cresselia up and about. Here we go, throw up my Garatina from the last video, which you should totally check out if you don't have one yet. And we're just going to throw a quick ball at this thing. See what happens. Please, one time, one catch, be done. Come on. Come on. One. Oh my God. Yes. First try, baby. <laughs> First try. Oh, I don't have to do it 50 times. Okay, we got it. Wow. First time. We're done. Cresselia's data will be added to the Pokedex. That's it. We really just got it the first turn with a quick ball. This is the power of the quick ball, ladies and gentlemen. And here is the walking animation for this Pokemon. Even though it's not walking, it's it's really floating and 
Look how cool this looks just to roam around the world with this thing. Oh my God. That's pretty much the video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. This has been great. I first turned Cresselia, so leave a like for that. That's, that's pretty awesome. And I will see you guys in the next video. This is Philly Beats You, and I'm out.